if log a plus 2 base 3 and that is equal to 3 log b and then base 3 then we want to express a in terms of b so these are just the technical meaning right i posted this question in, on our platform that is the short part if you are new here just make sure that you subscribe to the channel for content like this but if you're already here so you know that uh, we have a short form of this so this is a special request for someone and i'll mention his name before the video ends so make sure that you stay here to the end of the video now what it means here is that the way of solving this question is uh to apply the definitions of uh, the logarithm right so if you are living in particular society you have to obey the rules of uh, the society so the society here is uh, the logarithm society right so you want to express a in terms of b what it means here is that you have to solve this thing in such a way that our final answer should be a equal to something that's going to involve uh, the b so what i mean by the boss here a is going to be the boss or the manager here and then b are the, uh, the employees of uh, the a now to do that you have to obey the laws of uh, this logarithm let's see how to apply that our starting point is going to be the one given right so we are giving log of uh, a plus or plus two base three right that is equal to three log of what b and then b is base three is that okay so if you want to know the real meaning of the logarithm just check our playlist down below that is very very simple to understand right okay now uh, here your next step is going to be the way of solving this thing is that you have to apply what you know but uh, to the correction of uh, I think the name here is uh, I don't know if you get that correct JJB right so you made a very nice a nice comment in the comment section so right so that was the way of learning let's communicate you know, in the comment section below if you have any issues right so the way of doing that is you are saying you are saying to avoid that mistake here is that if you say something like this so let, let's have that on the screen so perfect that is a very nice mistake there so the key here is that these people are not in one bracket right if they are in one bracket what it means that they all belong to or they all have the same logarithm here right so they are all obeying uh, this law here right they are all obeying this guy here once again if you want to know the meaning of this that's why i say you should check the playlist them they are not in bracket right if they are in bracket then we can say that the possibility that uh, everything here is equal to the guy here is very high but since they are not in the bracket meaning that this guy the one the two here is coming from different place and then the log of a here is affecting what only this guy right so the log of what a base 3 is affecting only this one so the two is coming from a different family so the way of making this guy to join the logarithm family here is that you have to add log to the two right so the way of doing that is all not to change the nature of the question here so log of a plus i will say the plus is different so two we can introduce this guy here, log three base three right so log 3 base 3 is just 1. That is the definition. So once again, if you don't know the meaning of the other reason why the log to the same base is 1, let's hear from you in the comment section below, right? So adding this, one, we are just adding. This is just like saying uh, 2 multiplied by 1, right? So it's the same as a 2, right? So that is the concept we are doing here. So 2 multiplied by 1. This this will give me 1 by the definition, right? So it's just like the same thing. So we are not changing any nature of uh, the question here so everything is going to be equal to 3 log of what b and then what base 3 so now that this two year has joined the logarithm family then we, we can proceed and apply some of all the definitions of a logarithm to this particular question so which uh, logarithm uh, definition are we going to apply here now the key here is that look at something this guy the two here can go up right so the two here can vanish so this two here can vanish to somewhere here as, as well as this three here can also vanish to to the exponent so that is what the definition of the logarithm is saying that if you are done here you are attaching to the logarithm you can bring it to the top here or maybe if you are on the top here you can bring it to the down the vice versa right so depending on what you are looking for so we are trying to solve this logarithm expression here so now this is what you have 
log of 3 and then uh, log a base 3 right and then plus the 2 is going up so you have a log 3 base 3 exponent 2 have you see so the 2 goes up so everything is going to be equal to log of uh, a b base 3 exponent of exponent 3 is that okay so these are just the definitions of a logarithm that we are applying here but remember we know where we are going we want to have the a to be the boss so everything in terms of a to be equal to something right so that is where we are going once you have that at the back of your mind you are you, you, you i think you are on the right path now from this point we can proceed right so this guy here we can easily have this guy to be equal to a nine because these are numbers just that we are going to maintain this guy because this is a, a variable and a number which we cannot combine them together this guy is going to be a nine so we have a, a log of a and then base three and plus of log of nine right so base three everything that is equal to log of uh, b exponent three and then uh, base 3 right so this is what we are having now so what are we doing remember we just want to make sure that a is on one side of all the equation so a is equal to something that is where we are heading towards so, so we have to make sure that this log base 3 here and then everything here vanish right so we are going to have only a here. so how can we do that that is where you need to apply some definitions of the logarithm from this point that says that if these people are the same so what i mean by the people this base yeah, this base here are the same and then they are adding then what it means that we can multiply uh, the, 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 the the guy that they are carrying so the guy in front of them so this is a and then well, this is also another nine right remember the definition is saying that if the base are the same right so that's the first step so these people must be the same and then they are adding we can easily multiply these people that we can just assume that they are all coming from the same apartment is that okay now so what are we going to have here so we have a uh, let's put all of them in the same apart so this is the apartment that they have in log base three right so we have a uh, nine multiplied by what a right so maybe a multiplied by a so always the number first so nine what a is that okay so everything is going to be equal to log of four. b exponent three and then base three right okay gradually we are getting to what our final destination so our aim from this point here is so to make sure that the log base 3 vanish right so how can we do that we call something uh antilog right so some people will say antilog so whichever you want to pronounce it that is your own word. so here we are going to take in what antilog of what both sides right so both sides why are we doing this so we want to make sure that this guy vanishes so this is just similar to saying something that 2s equal to equal to 4 what do you do here you are going to divide here by 2 and then divide here by 2 right so dividing here by 2 in logarithm is that making this logarithm guy here vanish is taking ant log or maybe ant log right so ant log of uh, both sides that can help us make sure that this logarithm sign vanishes so taking that since this one will vanish you are going to have 9a is equal to b exponent of exponent 3 right so taking ant log help us to vanish or make this guy or we wipe the logarithm sign away right this can only be possible if you all they all have or the same or base is that okay if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give us a thumbs up maybe comment along if you have any issues right so So make sure that you comment in the comment section below if you want more of a logarithm question so that we can bring you more of something like this. Now here we know how to get to this point. This is very it's somewhat easy and it, maybe I should leave this thing. First. So here you can say that divide both sides by what? By 9 and then divide here by 9. So this guy vanished. So you can see clearly that we have our A to be equal to B exponent 3 everything on 9. Right? So everything on 9. So this should be what our boss exactly that's what 
we are looking for so a is going to be our boss as we said at the beginning of the video i visit that in terms of b meaning that b is part of what the employees right so this three is the an employee you are also an employee for sure b is also part of uh, the employee this is exactly the question is demanding you to solve everything step by step 